children is diagnosed with autism in the U.S. That's according to the CDC. WNCT's Brandon Truitt attended a conference where families learned how to better help children with this diagnosis. I have five daughters. Four of them have been diagnosed with autism. David Holler's daughters range from ages 8 to 15. Two are twins. For me, it's hard to say what's different in my life compared to other people's lives because this is what I know. Holler says people often don't understand the different types of autism. With autism, there is a wide range. There are uh, children who have a hard time functioning and there are children who function very well, so well that a lot of people wouldn't be able to identify them as having autism. His daughters are able to talk and get along with each other, but can find it hard to create friendships. A lot of the social cues that most people understand without ever having been taught them can be difficult. Holler advised families on how to handle an autism diagnosis. When you first get a, an autism diagnosis, um, some people seem to be able to just shrug it off and go, okay, that's what we're dealing with, let's go on from there. Other people get crushed by it. For him and his wife, it didn't get any easier. We've had that conversation four times, and it hurt pretty much every time. Holler says his family finds joy in celebrating the little things. They are wonderful. I wish I was as perfect as they are. Um, they, they're just great. They, they always surprise me with the great things they do. A father who refuses to let a disorder limit his daughter's possibilities. In Greenville, Brandon Truitt, 9 on your side.